It's a it's a team game rugby. We call it the ultimate team sport. Everyone's got a role to play. So you got to work together to get a good result. What tactics do you use to ensure you can support each other and have your best game on the pitch? Tactics can vary in, in games. It's important how you communicate with the players. So you understand how the people around you want to play. It's all about teamwork. It's all about having a chat. It's all about knowing what each other are doing. We constantly making sure and watching each other's back to make sure everyone's all right. Rugby, there's a lot of friendships off the pitch as well as working hard when we're together. You know, we do different stuff together. We're always going for coffee, going for coffees, the coffees, get the coffees afterwards, go for food. This is just another way to build the relationships, interact with each other, and uh, we're always there to help each other. You know, you, you go to some pretty dark places for each other. That's when we can really um, help each other out because we've built relationships that are built on foundations. Who are they going to in the team for fashion advice? Fashion advice. That's a tricky one. Um, probably no one. Uh, there's a few people I definitely wouldn't go to. Definitely no one on my watch. <laughs> I wouldn't go to Johnny Fo because he refuses to buy any clothes that aren't secondhand off eBay. <laughs> um, no, no, none of them. Are there any moments that stand out from your times on tour where your friendships have been tested? Friendships are probably tested like most just on the pitch. When you try something and it might not necessarily go to plan. Uh, you could be under a lot of pressure, five minutes, two minutes left in the game. That sort of tests your friendships when, when things aren't going too well on the pitch. So we all work very hard with each other while we're on the pitch, but off the pitch we're all very good mates. We're always there to help each other, which also helps when we come back in and we're playing rugby. It has a massive impact on and doing well as, as a team. You all get on pretty well. Do you make friendships for life? You know you have a good mate when... When you're constantly laughing with them. There's someone you can go to and talk to about your problems. He washes your underpants. You know he's a good lad. <laughs> That's all right, isn't it? When he'll walk you home from a night out and buy you a bit of food. And you make sure you wake up the next morning safe and sound. Mates matter. Mates matter. Mates matter. Mates matter. Mates matter. Mates matter.